<clears throat> Chat, two days from now, I will be living in Texas. That is right, I'm moving from the cold and desolate area of New York to the sunny and beautiful southern state of Texas. Why, you ask? Uh, I don't fucking know, really. Basically, I've always wanted to move south to warmer weather, and uh, Texas has a lot of good things going for it uh, in terms of businesses rising up, a lot of content creators moving there. I have family down there, I have friends down there, and uh, I got one of my best friends to move down there with me, so... Um, it's definitely a big chapter in my life, a big stepping stone. I've talked about moving to Texas for a while on the channel through the whole, you know, summer work process to get all the money saved up in order to afford it. Um, but that being said, I did graduate from college and I am about $90,000 in the hole in student debt. Sleepy Joe Biden, Joe Brr, please save me from all this money I owe. So that with rent and bills like internet and car insurance and all that adult stuff that I'm going to be paying soon. Yeah, I need a job. And I do have a job. I did get a job um, that I will be starting shortly after I move to Texas. I move in two days. Um, I start w work the week after that. Um, so I'll be alright financially, hopefully. I won't be making a killing, but I do need income in order to afford to live on my own. However, that will not stop me from streaming and making content. Um, ever since Pokemon 3 kind of died down, uh, I've been a little wishy-washy with streams. You know, I haven't been streaming every night. I'm taking a lot of uh, breaks, a lot of days off. Um, I've got addicted to, to Lost Ark in my off time and Elden Ring in my off time, which I've been playing on and off stream. The editing has been slowing down uh, for sure because it's a lot of more creative process editing rather than you know, clean cut video ideas like a Pokestuck video is. I get a lot of people asking me like, when will we play Pokestuck again? I do love Pokestuck. Pokestuck has done a lot for me. Um, but what can I do? All my times are, are pretty solid. So videos are going to be few and far between if I'm going for PBs. Um, which if I don't have the motivation for, I'm not going to do that. And I've pretty much milked it dry in terms of video ideas. I've done anything I can think of that will garner an entertaining video, and I know I've gotten some people throwing ideas at me here and there, but I try to stick to something I think works wholeheartedly, and anything that has like a little bit of, you know, well, if this happened, you know, it'd be, it kind of doesn't work, I kind of try to stray away from that. The reason I haven't been streaming as consistently every night is because I'm out of fucking ideas. No, I'm not out of ideas. The real reason um, is that I'm incredibly stressed out. This is, like I said, a huge chapter for me in life, uh, you know, living on my own, moving out of my parents' house for the first time since freshman year of college. When I moved out then, uh, I was miserable living away from home in the college dorm. Not because of the college dorm, mostly for other reasons, but um, this time around I should be fine. Uh, moving out with one of my best friends, uh, Armando, or, or as you know him, Armo. Um, and I have a lot of things going for me in terms of, you know, being self-sufficient and taking care of myself financially and emotionally and, you know, mental health wise. Um, although the last month has been pretty hectic and I've been pretty on and off mental health wise, we should be good after about a week or two, you know, living on our own in the new apartment, getting used to things. Besides moving, one of the big things that's stressed me out lately is getting a real job. Um, not only because of the fact that it's, I've never had a real job before with salary, uh, so that's stressful, number one, I don't know what to expect. Um, and number two, the, just the fact that I have to get a job, because from, you know, day one of streaming from my Xbox and my laptop to now, where the content has gone, gotten infinitely better, the plan was always do what you love for a living, stream, make content. Um, and I've been doing it for three years, as of January, last January. And I still haven't hit my stride where, you know, I can do this for a living. So it's really made me stop and think, which is, you know, I'm genuinely a, usually a very positive person. But even then, you get negative thoughts. Um... But when I watch other people's content that gets millions of views and stuff like that, 
I don't think that kind of stuff is out of my reach. If I had all it takes is all it takes is one little idea to spark a, a an algorithm and you know we hit a boom and momentum just snowballs. So I'm not gonna stop making content, um, but I do need money. So I think once I get settled in and I can get my head on straight and you know I'm used to working a job and I'm on a routine. I think regular daily streams will come back. Um, I have a couple ideas for um, scheduled segments for content. I want to uh, share more of myself with you guys, the viewers. Um, as a smaller channel, you can kind of be more personal with your viewers' relationships because there's less uh, of you compared to like a big streamer like Ludwig. I know on some he's on some parasocial shit. We're not there yet. Um, a lot of my viewers I end up becoming friends with because uh, I can I have the time to get to know them. Um, and game with them. Um, I've made many friends through uh, people coming into my Twitch chat and stuff. So I hope to be streaming a lot more of my life and doing a lot more uh, creative YouTube videos, trying to find something that works, something that's entertaining, that I like doing, and that people like to watch so we can hopefully garner new viewers uh, and see the channel grow, um, as well as keep gaming. My dream goal is to stream and game for a living, so we're still on the grind, no matter if I have a job or not. So yeah, that's me moving across the country. Um, like I said, been stressful, been on and off mentally wise. Um, haven't had full time to focus on the content because I've been planning the move and stuff like that. Uh, I'm in the process of packing all my shit. Uh, this entire office is coming with me. So that'll be cool to have my own uh, room living on my own, or I guess with Armando. And yeah, the rest of this video will be me moving and the uh the setup of my new streaming slash bedroom in texas so today's tuesday we leave on thursday but i've already begun to pack and as you can see we have vacuum sealed all the clothes i'm bringing any other clothes will be shipped to me at a later date um i've got some pots and pans that's my comforter for my bed. Bunch of bathroom stuff. All the, those are just clothes I had in my closets that are going to Goodwill that are gonna be gone. Um, these are about the only clothes I have for the week. As you can see, my entire closet spaces are completely cleaned out. As for the office space, I haven't really packed anything because I'm gonna do that tomorrow when we are uh, getting ready to pack the car. I will break down the setup for good, you know, take the legs off the tables, take the graphics card out of the computer, but I'll probably stream one last time tonight before I leave for Texas. I get one last New York stream in. So yeah, that's the process of moving so far. I'll update you tomorrow once the setup is gone. We'll do a little before and after. Here's before and the after. Everything is out and my room is empty. I'm in the driver's seat right now. Look at this fucking shit. My computer is like under all that somewhere. It's like filled to the fucking brim with shit. Like this is crazy. I don't know how this corner piece of the table is sitting in here. That's touching the edges and shit. My bed frame, my mattress is here. All my clothes. We got like a roof rack on top in the sunroof this is there's no shot that all my shit fit What Pharaoh you think's buried in there? <laughs> <laughs> Where 
All right, boys, we made it to Texas. Here's the uh, apartment tour officially. We got a little closet next to our doorway. And then this is the living room where we got Armo grinding out of Tetris. We built some Ikea furniture, brought my TV from home. Good space. There's actually a balcony out there that I'm not gonna show. Um, to the left immediately is the kitchen. We got a nice like island here. You can walk around and uh, dishwasher. Bunch of drawers. We cooked a little bit of eggs and sausages this morning. And then uh, stove top. Got a bunch of cabinet space, microwave, nice big fridge, decent size. And here we got laundry, little shelf space for some stuff. And then, you know, classic pantry with just cereal, peanut butter, Oreos. Actually, we did a bit of shopping. Some good stuff in here. 25 pound bag of rice. So yeah, that is the kitchen. And then you come over here and we've bought a comically large eight foot <laughs> folding table that is huge uh, for the dining room. We will be getting some chairs and stuff later. Uh, coming into here, we have the guest bathroom and Armo's bathroom. He's got his nice shower, standard stuff. And then, we go into Armo's room, which he has a temporarily king-sized blow-up mattress and his uh, little one desk setup he's got going on. He's trying to get a different desk soon, but, you know, we need to get jobs and start working. Look at the damn PC, though. Sheesh. That's Armo's PC, 3090 type shit. And then he's got two closets for the space. So, yeah, that's, he's got one big window, too, so that's, that's it for Armo's room. And then, lastly... We come back around to the right side and we have my room, which I packed my entire car full of stuff. So if we stand in the corner here next to the door, right to the right of the doorway, we got my streaming set up, set and ready to go. It's a little bit different because my mixer was not usually on the desk on the right here, but obviously the door is here, so we couldn't do that. And then my closet's over there, so we couldn't do it over there. So my mixer is now on the back left, and we had to do some changes in the wiring. My mic arm's now on the side of the desk. Uh, got some drawers for extra wires and stuff to hide in. Uh, and my PC is now on the floor, and also backwards. Uh, like this side is the open side with my like cooler and stuff. So it's not facing me, but that's actually good because when I sleep at night, right? This is my bed. When I sleep at night, the lights aren't facing me, so it doesn't, it's just less light to look at. Um, coming into my closet, I got a little bit of laundry stuff over here. Uh, let me turn the light on. Uh, this is my closet. So I've got, I'm going to get a drawer for my underwear and socks, probably put it down here on the right. But I've got my shoes and stuff on the bottom. Um, backpacks, a bunch of tools and stuff. Anything dress shirt wise is over here on the left. I put a hook on the wall for my jackets. Um, it's got a lot of shelving space. A lot of shelving space. Over here on the right is my hoodies, shorts and up top. Bunch of shelves up top. A lot of stuff to place to put clothes, that's good. And then this is my master bathroom, which is a singular bathroom for myself. I've got a bunch of stuff set up and then my shower, I replaced the shower head because the other shower was shit, but I've got a big old tub. So yeah, that is the apartment tour. We are living alone, just me and Armo in Texas now. Um, and I start work on Monday. So if you enjoyed the video uh, and want to support me going forward to becoming a top streamer on Twitch, subscribe and uh, catch you guys in some more gaming videos. See you.